Cincinnati. Got into high school. I mean, just basically trying to find what I love to do. And then I think my mom said we need to get a, you need to get a job. And then she said, "Oh, I'll go get a job at McDonald's, and then I'll negotiate. If I, they don't hire me, they got they don't hire me. You can't go work there." So she said, you got to hire me, then my son will come and work when I'm here. I'm, I'm his transportation. So I was like, okay. And they hired her and hired me at the same time. And then, okay. So after that, I mean, I was there for about eight years. I mean, when I got here, it was kind of difficult because... I walked down Nicollet Mall trying to find a job. And I got applications, some of them in paper, some of them online. So on the application, I said, do you have a disability? So I marked that on some of them. Some of them I marked no disability and see what will come back. So when I went back to check on the application, I was like, oh, we're still looking at your application. But I'm more than qualified to do the job. You see my resume right there. It says McDonald's. I was just, okay. It must be the disability. They think it's scaring them. I think it was mostly my disability that will turn companies away. So I know some jobs go by race, but I think this job looked past that. They saw my resume, I guess, and then they said, he's a very hard worker. I mean, I don't really leave jobs like some people do because you don't like it. You gotta make it fun. You gotta, you gotta make your job fun. <laughs> Today I work at um, at Allianz as a um, corporate service associate, and at I'm in the mailroom, so that's a job where I ship out supplies to our agents in the field. And the reason I got this job is because my mom saw LifeWorks, the company that works with disabilities, at a conference. She, she went up to them, my son needs a job. Can you get him a job? He said, yeah, I think we have a job for him, perfectly for him. And then it took a while for them to figure out, okay, where do you go? So when I got the job, I went in, I went in to look at the job. I was like, okay, this is a job. Just learn how to build kits. And after that, I went, went to my manager's house. I want to learn more. I want to move somewhere else. I don't want to do the same job. It's just... Doing the same things over and over is it's kind of boring for me. So I was I want to learn more. So he decided to get me a job on the, in Building B, third floor, doing name mail, forms, the letters. So it goes out to people. And then after that, I got bored of that. So I told my boss, hey, is there any other challenging jobs I could do? So I'll see, how about you for... Try to fulfill orders. So that's where you put the orders together, put it in a box. You grab it off the shelf. It's like form numbers, like AMK 105. You gotta know all the form numbers. So you just grab all the stuff they put on the order sheet. You grab it off the shelf, you put it in a box or an envelope. Well, depends on how big it is. And then you ship it out on a computer that's FedEx. We work with FedEx, so... Um, and then after that, it's just been there, I think, 12 years. The word disability means a lot to some people. Like CEO, they think, oh, he has no arms or no legs, and no, he can't do this. But I find out, I, have, I live with people with disability. I find out people with disability have all kinds of limitations, but they'll work around it. They'll find a way to get the job done to their capabilities. So I don't 
look at people in the, like that. I mean, they're my community. I gotta fight for them. Employment for Minnesota is one of the lowest, but not for disability. It's still the highest one out there. We need to work on that instead of taking money away from people, programs from disability programs, and then give more money to the programs for disability so we can have more access to um, health, anything. Ten years from now, I want to um, run for Senate, go in Tom Harkin's shoes, and then go finish the American Disability Act because he said it's not done. Still needs work needs still some work needs to still be done to it.